Good morning, everyone. It's Christoph, and hello from the beautiful Beverly Hills Markers, <laughs> Beverly Hills Markers, Beverly Hills Farmers Market. Uh, one of my favorite places to go every Sunday morning. It's from 9 o'clock to 1 p.m. here in the heart of Beverly Hills, right next to the City Hall and the Civic Center. And uh, I'll give you a little tour and show you why I love this place so much. First of all, this is the beginning of the market here at Civic Center Drive, just south of Burton Way. You can come and buy beautiful live plants, um, which is great. And these are very much the kind of plants that can grow here in Southern California. And actually, for those of you around the country, maybe you want to see some of the kinds of plants that grow well here in Southern California. So camellias do well here, succulents, any kind of succulent does well. We have a, you know, this LA was once a desert, so hence succulent plants really seem to do well. Uh, rosemary, thyme, herbs, bougainvillea is a big one. And for those of you that don't know, bougainvillea comes in lavender, comes in a reddish color and a yellowish color. These I don't know the name of. Uh, this is potato vine, I believe. We have these in our house. They're beautiful purple flowers. And um, so it's great. Um, I forget what those are called too. Anyways, those of you watching in Facebook, you can tell me what they're all called. <laughs> I don't know the names as long as they look good and they fit my garden well, that's all I care about. Uh, when I was a kid, my mom came from the south of France in the country. My dad came from South Korea. And so every summer, every year from when I was three years old, I spent the summers in France, or most of the time in France or in Asia. But as a kid, my mom's relatives all had farms and they have farm animals, so I love, love farm animals. We have today chickens and goats and uh, tortoises and rabbits. And oh, the horses are over there. People are running the, ho running the horses. Hey Trish, how are ya? So anyways, it's so much fun to see the animals. And although Beverly Hills is very modern today, as you can see by some of the architecture in this part of the city, this is kind of our industrial part. We have our water and pow our power plant here. And, um, and then our farmer's market here, which runs two blocks here on Civic Center Drive. That's one of our city parking structures. And just the other side, you can't see it, is our city hall. Oh, where are the horses? So, there are the horses. So if you have kids, it's a great place to bring your kids. You can ride the ponies. There's some kids having fun riding the ponies. Once in a while, they have a camel as well. So let's, so let's go around. I'll show you the whole market. Why not? My favorite vendors. So. Great fruit and produce, and it's all locally grown and organic, meaning they're all from local vendors. Uh, there's a lady here who's my French apple lady from Kuyama Farms. They have the most amazing apples. Yeah, I'll show you some of the fruits and vegetables, so. Apples, we love apples. Oh, and Gabrielle's learned something new. So these are all the apples this week. Do you guys love apples? Pink lady apples are really, really delicious. And Granny Smith. So basically, we don't eat processed foods or preserved foods. We basically eat all organic, clean, no sugar. I try not to eat wheat. So Gabriel uh, discovered a new way for desserts. So it's nice to have something sweet at night, you know, when you have a sweet tooth. And since I don't eat chocolates and cookies and all that fun stuff, Gabriel discovered how to make steamed apples. I'm not kidding you, steamed apples, and they're absolutely delicious. So I like the Granny Smith, which is those dark green apples. Gabriel likes the Pink Lady, so we take a couple, you put them in the steamer, you steam them for, I don't know, 30, 40 minutes, and they're absolutely delicious. You can eat them with some roasted pecans or some walnuts, and they're great. This is one of my orchid dealers. Always beautiful orchids to choose from. Lots of different colors, styles, and shapes. So quite often I come here, I have quite a few orchid dealers, but I come here and I buy orchids for my open houses, right? It's always good to have beautiful, fresh orchids in your open houses. So. Anyways, I like them in my own house, too. <laughs> Wonderful dates. I'm not a big fan of dates, but if you are, they're great. We have salad dealers, and all they deal in is all different kinds of salads and, and edible greens and chives and herbs. Look at all the beautiful fresh herbs. Really nice. Too bad I don't cook, because if I cooked, it'd be a lot more interesting. This vendor has a lot of Chinese vegetables. Chinese broccoli is something we eat a lot of which they haven't had in the last few weeks. Nope, not to, oh, they do have it today, good. They have rapini, um, Chinese broccoli, Thai broccoli, bok choy, for those of you who know bok choy. This side is all of our um, kind of vendors with fresh juices, fish. Oh, I'll show you that, it's busy right now, but I'll, let's take a look. I'm not a big fish fan, but they have all sorts of great freshly caught fish. Swordfish, salmon, sushi, Sometimes they have clams. I've seen um, 
Oh gosh, uh, sea urchins, live sea urchins they've had here. There's a sprout table. More fresh cut flowers. Looks like tulips are in, style, in season right now. Pretty, about ready to bloom. Um, let's see, we have a chocolate vendor, guy that makes hamburgers. I have to be honest, I've never tried the cooked foods, but I'm sure it's great. Tacos. The other day I saw, we have a new vendor that does Afghanistanian food, which I thought was really interesting, and I haven't even checked it out to see what it is, but I've never seen Afghanistanian food, so I'll have to check it out. Our berry dealer, and he's usually sold out very quickly, so. Blueberry, all kind of amazing berries. Really, really great berries. This is the north side of the market. You can see the hills behind us. We have our strawberry vendor. So you can see what beautiful strawberries there are. I don't know, do you guys have farmer's markets in your towns? If you do, give me some likes and love. I'd love to hear about your farmer's market. Here's some wonderful berries. Berry salsa, have you ever heard of strawberry salsa? <laughs> More flowers. And they're always different every week. I don't know which ones are your favorites. Let's see what we got today. Oh, Frisia, those are always beautiful. Ooh, Lysianthus, those are really pretty, right? Stalker, one of my favorites, it smells so fresh. Large spur, delphiniums. You can certainly make a beautiful table arrangement with the flowers from here. Avocados are back. Avocados were gone for a month or two, and now they're just coming back the last couple of weeks. So happy to have avocados. Oh, eggs. This ranch has the best eggs. I mean, they're really good. Not quite as good as picking them yourself on the farm, but they're pretty darn good. More vegetables. Oh, yeah, the sprout guy. This is kind of cool. All sorts of live sprouts. Daikon radish, rambo radish, Ethiopian mustard, yellow mustard, kale. So they cut and trim the sprouts you want. If you're cooking or your salads. And then mushrooms. Sometimes they actually bring the mushrooms on the how they're grown, which is kind of cool. The beautiful fresh mushrooms and more avocados. So that's the end of the north side of our farmer's market. So if you're ever in Beverly Hills, just want to check it out and see how things are. So many locals come here, you see everybody at the farmer's market. I've seen many, many celebrities from Diana Ross to Madonna to, um, oh gosh, I forget all the names, but if they're here in LA or they live nearby, you'll see them here. This is Sylvester Stallone, I've seen uh, our former governor, um, I forget his name right now, but anyways, fun place to come, fun things to buy, just nice to get outside and enjoy a little bit of the fresh air and the beautiful world of Beverly Hills. Have a great day, everyone. See you all soon.